Can't ignore Martin Lee forever. I need to start investigating him. All units, we are getting... Hey, we're running another piece on Jefferson Davis, and it's made me wonder, how's his son Miles doing? Not good. I've been there. The loss is all you can think about. He needs something to do outside of school. Maybe a part-time job? It's not a bad idea, but it has to be the right job. Something that makes him feel useful, like what he's doing matters. Kind of think you just described Feast. MJ, that's perfect. I'll talk to May about it. That's what I'm here for. Happy to help. You know these little guys pretty well, huh? Getting there. Sandra always knew him best, of course. Sandra? Oh, uh, my, my wife. Well, tell Sandra she's got some fine birds. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, sure we are, Spider-Man. Thanks again. And please, keep an eye out. Officers are pursuing a truck carrying an IED. Requesting officers on scene in Bloomingdale. why Jonah paid me the big bucks. Attention unit, we've got a chase in progress. Proceed to Morningside Heights. Supposedly, Fisk made his fortune selling these spices. I mean, they're good, but not that good. I gotta stop that car. Guys have an impressive social circle. Hey, 
it just got more interesting. Open fire! Oscorp. I've got my issues with how they operate, but can't deny their success. Ten thirty-four. Officers are taking fire from a group of demons. Report came in from Dublin. Demons are getting worse than Fisk ever was. Aren't slowing down. What are they trying to accomplish? Good one. Don't mention it, officer. Demons are out of control, terrorizing the whole city. Showing off. Demons aren't just a street gang.
Every day, in every way, I'm getting better and better. Why doesn't it ever feel like it? All units, officers are pursuing a truck carrying an IED. Any officers near Firehouse, please copy. Pigeon alert! Come on! It's a fast one! I hope nobody sees me doing this.
Okay. Uh, hit me up and let me know if you can hear my audio or whether I fucked it. But it says that it's working. But when has that ever meant things are actually working? Sweet. Cool. All right, so let's see if I can stop getting bodied. That'd be nice. Friends, today we have a very special caller breaking important news right here because where else? Mayor Osborne, thanks for calling in. No, thank you, Jonah. When you were publishing the Bugle, you were always fair to me. Tough, sure, but fair. Well, that's my job, Mr. Mayor. All I have is my integrity, and I won't compromise it for anyone. Now, what's this crucial breaking news you're revealing for the first time anywhere on my show? Well, after the brutal, cowardly city hall bombing that almost claimed my life, it's clear our understaffed police department needs help. And I want to reassure the people of New York that I am providing it. Aha! I said it! You all heard me say we needed this. Are you using my idea of bringing in cops from Lake Placid? Ah, no. Though that was a fine idea. No, this would be a security contractor, much like the ones our military uses to assist our troops overseas. I can't name it until the contracts are signed, but their qualifications are impeccable. Well, that sounds terrific, Mr. Mayor. So, of course, I'll have to reserve my tough but fair final judgment until I have all the facts. I'd expect nothing less. And let me stress, this is in no way replacing our brave officers of the law, just augmenting them in a way that cuts through the red tape and gets results. And results are what we want. You know, I'm glad you're here, so I can share my theory on how Spider-Man may well be working with the demons. And a fascinating theory it is, I'm sure. But my doctors are advising me to get some rest now, so if you don't mind. Oh, of course. Thank you for calling in, Mr. Mayor. My lines are open for you anytime. Jared, did you hear? Tough, but fair! That's our new slogan. I don't care who else is using it. Don't care. I want to get to that barge because I've heard that, like, people look stupid on it. Oh, it's going to take ages to get there. You can barely swim. Officers are under fire. Proceed to morning Screw it. Messed up piece. Alright, officers under fire. Let's see if I can knock it bone this time. Demons are getting worse than this ever was. Hold tight, officers. The web swinging cavalry's here. When you string together combos, you look kind of stylish, but it's really simple. It's also really simple to fuck up and make a mistake and get bodied. As I'm demonstrating right now. What the fuck was that? That was weird. That's not a normal thing that happens. Hope you're all appreciating the Maguire attire. Down. I'll let you take it from here, officers. Nothing like a masked menace to bring. Oh, right, I was doing that black cat thing. Another camera. Looks like black cat, all right. 
know I disappointed you when I couldn't go straight, but why mess with perfection? Oh. Where the fuck? Oh. Hello, cat. I think they sell rare wine here. She's branching out. Gotta try and get ahead of her. All units, officers are pursuing a truck carrying an IED. Please proceed to Columbia. Curbside service. Bomb in the truck. Gotta disable it. Oh, fuck. Pizza time. Man, that Spider Man PS2 game was so good. Attention, all units. We have confirmed reports of an active bomb. Report came from the vicinity of Riverside. Honestly, that, this game looks how I remember the PS2 game to look, but then when you look at footage... Love that shot. The game looks really rough now, but of course it does. It's, you know, over 10 years old. So it's obviously a picture of that that I need. Looks like the demons are planting bombs. I better check in with the cop in charge before this turns into another city hall. Another bomb threat, officer? You know it. Same procedure. Disable the primary, then go after the secondary device. Got it. Not again! Not on my watch! Bloody hell. Should we throw the last guy off the roof? Fun. <clears throat> I think we should. Oh man! <laughs> oh, that's annoying. Don't think about the block of C4. This is wired to. Oh, what? Is there no? Oh, okay. No. Uh, oh shit, uh... I can't brain, I can't puzzle, what? Oh crap. Oh, okay, I'm just dumb. But how do I... Oh my god, I'm being so stupid. Oh, oh, okay. Right. No, uh... 
Oh, crap. Like that? Oh, shit. Um... Why is that not working? Oh. Oh, fuck. That did it. Or at least there wasn't an actual timer on that. Damn. Dead man switch. The other bombs are armed. Need to disable them before they explode. What? Oh, fuck. You gotta go? Alright. Thanks for tuning in. See you later. Stay safe. I think I'll go back to no commentary now. <laughs> This vial of the lizard's blood, I was able to mix up a cure and turn him back into Dr. Connors. Too bad it didn't last.
Hey, Pete. This lab monitors the health of marine life. And we've got a bunch of medicine on site if you need it. But the effects these diseases have, they're just... They are not something any living creature should go through. Looks like there's a bacterial infection in the fish. I better take care of it before the food supply is contaminated. Found an antibacterial spray in the lab that should heal the fish. I just need to spray it over the water. And fast, before people start getting sick. First step, get to the docks. I bet whatever's in those barrels caused the problem. Gotta get him out of the water. Call me your friendly neighborhood garbage man. These barrels are smarter than some of the guys I usually fight. Now that it's clear, this is a perfect spot to spray. If I spread it evenly, the water currents will take it far and wide. Gotta cover a wide area. fish will spread it to other fish, which is good, because there's not much for me to swing from further out. Based on the water currents, there's another area I need to hit. More barrels. Definitely the source of the bacteria. I'll get rid of them. Great thing about barrels, they don't shoot at me. The downside is, I don't think these barrels appreciate my quips. Clear to spray. Come on, fishy fishies. This is good for you. This is why I never had an aquarium. I bet someone calls this into Jameson as Spider-Man, water polluter. Okay. Time to find a spot to scan my finny friends and make sure they're cured. All clean. Well, by the standards of the docks. We stopped an outbreak before it started. It'll be tough for Oscorp to argue this station isn't pulling its weight. Cameras aren't cheap. If Felicia's really strapped, why is she leaving them lying around? I love making you chase me, Spider. Someday I might even let you catch me. Just not today.
There you are. Black Cat does enjoy playing games with people, especially me. MJ's hunch was right. The place is crawling with demons. Gotta take these guys out, then have a look around. Hello, Mikey. I didn't know you were still here. Should have said something. It's time to Metal Gear this shit, mate. Oh, you're about to disappear, are you? Oh, that's cool. No worries. Best of luck. No, that's alright. Best of luck not getting Meteor to death. Damn it, I was supposed to stealth him. Fuck. Be quiet. Uh, what am I supposed to do? Shit, have I fucked up? There we go. Okay, that's all of them. Oh, high security lock. They use these on banks, not recycling centers. Maybe if I can find where it gets its power from. Oh, yeah, that makes more sense. Need my electric webs. Well, that did something. It looks like the circuits need a little more juice. There. Looks like the circuit's still stable. Maybe there's another junction box close by. Gotcha. Almost there. One more box should do it. That's it! from Fisk's armory.
truck bombs. This is crazy. These must be where they're planning to attack. Wait. These are Osborne campaign offices. Lots of high-tech equipment. Maybe later I can recycle this stuff into some weapons of my own. Explosives from Fisk's construction site. This wasn't a gang war. The demons were stealing from Fisk to go after Mayor Osborne. Hey, did you find Lee? No, but you were right. Lee's using this place as a front for the demons. Bomb making, gun running. Oh my god. And it looks like they're planning another attack. This time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. We must have some kind of beef with Norman Osborne. I found an address here. I think it's their staging area. If I hurry, I might be able to stop them. Be careful. Yuri, it's me. Make it quick. I'm busy getting yelled at by my boss. Martin Lee and the demons are planning another attack, this time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. Are you sure? We've had a lot of false leads in the past week. Trust me on this one. I'm sending you the address of a recycling center. You'll find all the evidence there. Got it. I'll get those campaign offices evacuated. But if you're wrong about this, you're gonna help me find a new job. Consolidated shipping. A lot of guys. I should try to do this quietly, but also with style.
She's not out here. Better check inside. Huh. Invoice from an auto shop. Pale horse rides. That's one expensive tune-up. What else can I find around here? They have bases all around the city. This is bigger than I thought. Looks like the demons have an army. As if one deadly glowing whip wasn't enough. I don't know what I was expecting, but it was definitely not this. Stop the demon's attack on Osborne's campaign offices. Did you find Lee? No, but I found something we should look into. It's a place called Pale Horse Ride. Sounds familiar. I'll check it out and get back to you. I think I stopped the demon's attack on Osborne's campaign office. Nice. Fine. No, but I found something we should look into. It's a place called Pale Horse Rides. Sounds familiar. I'll check it out and get back to you. <laughs> Silverbird, we're descending to location. There's another one. Safety's off. Well, this is new. No, no, no. This one's mine. All right. I'm executing this son of a. Hey! That's not how we do things. Down! Pow! Code SM1. Whoa, whoa! Before we do this. Who the hell are you guys? Code SM1. Code SM1. Holding for orders. Copy code SM1. I have a visual. Hold for Silverbird. Entrance. Solid eight out of ten. Nine out of ten. Release him. 
He works with us. Yuri, explanation, please. This is Silver Sablanova, head of Sable International, a private security force, paid for by Mayor Osborne. Oh, the mayor has a pet army now? Next time you get in my way, I will not be so gentle. Go. We'll talk later. Sorry about that Sable thing. I should have told you earlier, but it all happened so fast. It's okay. We're still best buds. We're not best buds. Well, that took a dark turn. Anyway, Sable has the mayor's ear and unchecked authority. We've searched that address you gave me, found plenty of evidence of a bomb plot, but nothing that leads back to Martin Lee. I'm working on that. Hey, MJ. Hey, so I dredged up some records on Martin Lee's other business holdings. He's got places all over the city. Huh. The locations line up with a map I found at that shipping business. I'll check them out. Let me know what you find at each one, and I'll work on building a case. You got it. I'm headed to Lee's office at Feast to see if I can learn more about why he's doing this. And what he's got planned next. Okay. Say hi to May for me. Wait, you don't think she's in danger, do you? No. Lee's only got one target on his mind. Norman Osborne. Another call from Doc. Peter, I wanted to make sure you're still available. I can't pay you yet, but I've pulled enough strings to keep the wolves from the door a bit longer. If we can get up and running, I know this new version of the project will attract investment. Massive investment. Stay ready. Fingers triple cross, Doc. Every other shelter wouldn't let me bring my dog. This one? Great! Forgot how much I love photography. Sable agents. You're welcome. Got it. This is Control. Boss wants a status update on two bridges. Over. Control. Rooftop outpost under fire from demons. The enemy of my enemy is... Guys, come on! Scaring the pigeons! <laughs>
look of appreciation on the sable guys is all the reward I need. Or is that the consultation? Masked up peace. Magnifique. Yuri was a detective at the Chinatown Police Department when we met. She... VIP card for the nightclub. Harry always tried to include me. about Sable International. Let me see. They're an international security firm, usually hired by governments to end revolutions, or start them. The last thing we need is a city full of trigger-happy mercenaries. Whoa, social media is blowing up. They're setting up checkpoints around the city, doing random stop and frisks. This is crazy. No, this is Norman Osborne feeling threatened. <laughs> Hey guys, bird watching? I saw some pigeons over there. You've already lost! Can't have the ones inside feeling left out. Going down. MJ, I'm at the first location on your list, and guess what I found? Demons? Give the lady a prize. See if you can figure out what they're up to while I introduce myself. Time to metal gear this shit. Or Batman, depending on which you prefer. Weapons and web shooters OSP. 35 hit combo. Fucking hell, that's not going to be easy. Uh, I'll take out the snipers. Then I'll probably just go, go right in because I'm going to have to take out as many as I can. Any more 
snipers. Doesn't look like it. Let's go say hello. Sleep it off. Oh shit, fucked it up. Like fish. Okay, halfway there. Whoa, okay, calm down. Oh, there you go. Nearly there. One more. One more. You guys can up your game because those last guys yawn. Sweet. Cool. Now I can fuck up as much as I need to. Peter, that location is supposedly an importer of souvenirs for Chinatown shops. What they're importing is not something I want as a memento. Drugs? Demons. Looks like they bring in their buddies in shipping containers. Explains how foreign nationals with criminal records are getting into the country. You guys look mad. I admit, I used all my good points on the others, but I don't mind repeating myself. This is like when the band's doing its fourth encore and you just kind of want to go home. Oh my god, I just noticed my combo. Oh my god! Sweet Jesus! I guess you could say right now that I'm being a superior Spider-Man. Fuck me! Oh, finally lost it. Okay. Safe to say 35 wasn't too bad a target after all, huh? Is that it? Guess not. I like how there was just one dude. MJ, call the police. All the demons are incapacitated. And don't forget to bring me a souvenir. Nice. I have my moments where I don't totally suck at video games, I guess. Now that I'm doing optional stuff again, I guess I'll uh, put on an optional suit. What are we thinking? Homecoming for a bit? I don't feel so good, Mr. Stark. I'm not being the fucking ghost skull. It looks stupid. It's like the only suit in the game I don't like. Black Cat's been here. She was doing this in person the first time I caught her. Or did she catch me? This can't just be some elaborate flirtation. Hasn't she heard of dating apps? She's up to something. Hello, cat. That's Ty Stone's place, and it's full of priceless art. You're playing with fire, Felicia. I guess that's how you roll. Okay, what's nearby?
Pigeon? Pigeon! Folks, I have received unsettling reports of Spider-Man in our public parks where children play, apparently, stalking pigeons. <laughs> yes, wild pigeons. You may wonder if he's gone insane. A perfectly valid question. But have you heard of the Goliath bird-eating spider? I'll spare you the gory details, but it's a spider big enough to devour birds. Now, Spider-Man sticks to walls like a spider. He jumps like a spider. What else does he do like a spider? There it is. There's a pigeon. Yeah, gotta get him. This pigeon knows the city better than I do. Come on. God, they're fucking perfect shots. Guys, 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 we all love a parade, but you gotta get permits first. Carjacker delivery. There's a bomb in the truck. Gotta disable it. Oh god, he threw it into the building. <laughs> it's like fucking Civil Wars opening all over again. Oh, fuck. Wasn't my fault, okay. It was everyone else's fault. Oh, let's do another one of these research buildings. There's so fucking many of them. Hey, is that the last backpack? Can't talk. Is that the last backpack that I need? Oh my god, that's a crime. I guess I'll do that because, you know, I'm supposed to be a superhero or whatever. It's not like Sable Internet. Okay, the people in the top floor apartments are really annoyed with you right now. No need to thank me, Sable dudes. Although it's kind of rude you didn't. Okay, what was I doing? Oh, right. My parents died in a plane crash. I still can't tell anyone they were government agents. Wish I knew more about them. I wish anyone did. Definitely wouldn't want a fucking film based around them, though. Especially not one starring Andrew Garfield. Oh, right, there's a... Units map 
mass hostiles have taken a bus of civilians hostage. Officers needed in Hudson Town. Nice composition if I do say so myself. What am I supposed to be photographing? Oh crap. Well beautiful. Okay. Uh Oh alright, fine. Just for a bit. So weird. I don't know what it's supposed to be. Turns out you're not very stealthy when you're a fucking flaming skull. tour for you. Get my good side. Spirit of spider. Okay. Felicia thinks she's toying with me, but I learned something in each of these scenes. Alternate universe where Uncle Ben never died, okay. Meow. I think some big time lawyer lives here. I bet she's after his client list to find new targets. Hate to admit it, but she's one smart cat. Amazing spider, okay. Guys trying to steal the powers of other spider based heroes. Huh. Okay, be careful in here, Pete. This station analyzes hazardous chemicals, and basically trying to figure out how to counteract them if they ever got out into the world, which <coughs> hopefully they never will. Oh no, someone broke in and stole a volatile rocket propellant. They must have cracked the container because it's leaking. From the timestamp on the security cameras, it just happened. I need to get it back. 
My spider bots are still just prototypes, but this is a good time to test one. Its sensors can follow the chemical trail. Better than me swinging up on the... Gotta find a quiet place to deploy the spider bot, where I can hang out and guide it. Not only is Mini-Me cleaning up the spills, it's leading me right to the thief. Thieves hiding in crowds. I'll disperse them with a subsonic blast. Don't hurt anyone, but it's super annoying. Lucky this stuff's only dangerous over a long exposure. Or if it combusts. Maybe. Maybe not. End of the trail. He's in. He's running. Gotta wrap him up with a web burst. <laughs> Got him. Now to get the fuel back. Amazing. Got it. Now I just need to return the fuel to the station. This little spider bot's useful. If I can ever find a way to make him cost effective, they'd be a big help. Back where it belongs, I beefed up the station security and sent Yuri the camera footage to convict the thief. Not a bad day's work. This is one station that was already earning its keep. It should be safe from being shut down, especially now that the chemicals are locked away. Okay, I'm done having creepy weird head. I don't like it. Back to pizza time. Kick it up a notch. Whoops, pressed the wrong button. We're done. Bone saw is ready. What's this landmark over here? Empire State University, the old alma mater, and holder of my student loans. Is that a real university, or is that just where all the Marvel stuff takes place in school years? I have no doubt a real university exists in its place, but I just don't know if it's called ESU. Not long ago, the demons committed another heinous act of terrorism when they took a tour bus and all of its occupants hostage. We have one of those occupants here with us now. A Mrs. Edna Packer of Edina, Minnesota. What happened, ma'am? Well, these horrible men in masks came on board with guns and held us all hostage. I thought I'd never see my kids again. And then the police saved us and, and Spider-Man, of course. He was so brave. Mrs. Packer, I am so glad you're safe. And also that I can enlighten you about Spider-Man. You're from out of town, so you don't know what a menace he is. But he saved me and my husband. But look at the big picture. Do you have these kind of crimes in a diner? Oh, certainly not. And do you have Spider-Man in a diner? Uh, no. And that is not a coincidence. You're welcome, Mrs. Packer. I consider explaining these things a public service. Never changed, JJ. See if I can perfect these chumps. Never mind. 
Oh my god. He's located in New York Uni. Okay, I figured as much, basically. I think I've asked this question before, but what's what's there in the real world where Avengers Tower is? Also, where where are the uh, where's the Twin Towers at? I kind of want to see what's in there, what what there is there in this. Obviously, as I have no idea where New York is, like. Geogra geographically, I don't know where it would be. But I do kind of want to see what uh, the 911 site looks like in this game. I'll do this little mini thing while uh, you're looking it up. If I can get up there. Felicia's keeping busy, but I'm catching up. Let's see where she hit this time. Street level? No. Oh, something over here. I'm warm. Got it. Cornelius Van Lunt's place. She's hitting places full of one-of-a-kind valuables. She must be working for someone. Otherwise, why not just steal cash? Oh, okay, so it's there. So actually not too far from here. Uh, so like what, about here? There? Somewhere around about here. Ooh, love that shot. Covered it over, that's kind of disrespectful. Oh god, no, not a plane. It's getting ominous, I don't like it. Alright, I'm pretty high up. I don't think I'm going to get a much better viewpoint than one of these. I think there's any obvious sort of missing areas, I want to say. Can't see anything. Oh wait, it was more about here-ish. Okay, well, let's go to the top of Avengers Tower.
This isn't Avengers Tower. Oh, but it is high up, Jesus. Oh, okay. Whoa, oh, uh, oh, right, okay. I have no idea where 200 Park Avenue is on a game map, dude. But there's definitely no big towers. So I guess 9-11 did happen in this universe. Oh well. I was just curious. Oof, that's a drop. Don't full screen the video now. Whoa, fuck! I don't know what the hell I just did there, but I clearly did something. Yeah, I knew about that. Now, friends, you know I'm always open to differing points of view. So after a police officer called me out on social media for being too hard on Spider-Man, and it went viral and people just wouldn't shut up about it, I agreed to a debate. Officer, welcome. Thanks for having me. Yeah, so, uh, so me and my guys went to shoot out with some desperate characters who had nothing to lose. I mean, they didn't care if we all lived and died. And somebody would have, trust me, if Spider-Man hadn't helped us. All right, fair enough. I'm not saying he never does anything good. I'm saying he causes more problems than he solves. You had to go to the Academy, right? Be thoroughly trained. You have rules to follow. Sure, but he seems to know what he's doing, too. It worked out for the best this time. Next time, how do we know Spider-Man won't cause the deaths of all concerned? Well, he never has before, has he? I believe we'll just have to agree to disagree. Thank you for your service. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, man. Also, I'm dating the stream info to no longer say uh, no commentary. Because, let's be honest, I'm talking more than I'm not. Why is that happening? Oh, okay. Holy you are shit. my biggest fan. I can't let the demons kill him. You probably feel ganged up on right now. Maybe try not bombing the city. Let's try not dying. Stop dying. You're welcome. Okay, I'm feeling kind of OCD. Let's change suits again.
I thought I had just the normal 2099 suit, but maybe not. Oh, yes, I do. Miguel O'Hara. Ah, this one looks weird. Shall I do a story mission? Oh, what the fuck? Who fires a rocket launcher at that close range, you idiot? MetLife building, huh? Wonder why they replaced it. What is the MetLife building? What does it do? Is it a company? Thanks for saving our butt, Spidey. You're welcome, scary fascist soldier guys. What did I say? Against the demons. Bad. Insurance company. Oh, so maybe they just didn't have the copyright, so replaced it with Avengers. Makes sense. Can't forget to stop by feast. Need to get a look at. Le all right, all right. I guess I'll go do some story. His office. I tell you, know you've been doing side stuff too long. When Parker's like, no, we got to do story. Where's my Spider Gwen suit at? Still voiced by Yuri Lowenthal, of course. Hey, they did it for the Mary Jane sheet in Spider Man 1 on the uh, PlayStation 2. But then again, they took that out because of, you know, lesbians. Cowards. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? Uh, me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to, uh, stay busy. Might help him, too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No. Why? Just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. I should check out Lee's office. Man, Aunt May's doing a really bad job of cutting that carrot. Need help with those veggies? <laughs> I learned a long time ago, you're more help staying out of the kitchen than in it.
You want me to call Mrs. Morales first? I'll be fine. I suspect she'll be relieved to talk to someone who's been there. I think she does need help with those veggies, let's be honest. The more I know about the MetLife building, how about that? Glad to see you're okay. Hanging in there. May said you were at the bomb. I was praying for you. Thanks. I appreciate it. Hmm. This office is locked. How do I get in there? Quietly. Smooth. Huh. Never seen that room before. Whoa, what the high voltage lines. What needs this much power? I think I can overload that junction box. But the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can get that information. No, I don't know when that will be. What would Ben do? room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. Lee did so much for New York. I can't believe he was hiding such darkness inside him. I'd never even heard of Mr. Negative Mr. before this game, to be honest. A key. wonder where the lock is. I'll leave this up for a minute. Lee sounds conflicted. Almost like he didn't want to head down this path. Can't believe he was hiding such bees inside him. <laughs> huh. The shrine in the photo is missing the picture. All right, time to Professor Layton this shit. This is the ghost story Lee's father read to him. About a demon that could only be mastered through balance. Hmm. Some kind of puzzle lock. I wonder what it could possibly it's mean. Oh, I see. Yes. Six stock photo. <laughs> yeah, I did hear about that. But hey, if they pay for the license, then whatever, I guess. What are you hiding, Lee? He's giving his powers to the others. How does Lee imbue these with his power? Bioelectric induction? Compressed phase shift? Lee sure is obsessed with masks. Is it a Jungian thing? Like, he needed to pretend to be someone else to let his darkest feelings out? Pretended to be a demon, until he became one. This is all about Norman Osborne. His whole career. Well, he must have been obsessed with him. Feeding 
off my anger. Father would say I've lost the path of balance that he could never understand. The only way to fight a monster is to become one. Uh, yeah, it actually is a stock photo, I believe. I think there's a couple in this game. Oh, this is the folder MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. I believe there's about to be a quick time event, so I better brace myself. Oh, maybe not. It's a burn room. Wired to destroy evidence. This isn't Pacific Rim. What? Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. I get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done. <laughs> I'm definitely not a villain. They're just NPCs, you can't expect them to give a shit, Peter. Captain Watanabe. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack point. Where? When? Still working on that. But I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. MJ, hey. Just checking in. Peter, hey. Can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait, remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. 
And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more. But I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah. See ya. Dinner? Huh. What should I cook? I'm sure it will all go to plan. I'll stop now from for Umbrella. You know it. Oh, hi, Doctor. How are you? Parker! Exciting news. Come by the lab. Uh, like now? This is my divining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Uh, okay. Be right there. Yeah. Get him. Wonder if this means I have a job again. Guess I can stop by just for a minute. I'm totally not working on a villain suit, boy. <laughs> Fucking hell, CJ. <laughs> Hey, Doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff. We really need to get better about organizing our workspace. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. Sides of the box. Uh... Oh shit, aim. I never noticed that on my first playthrough. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think that should do it. Ready? <laughs> Everything okay? This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a- Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I, uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction. Of troll. No, don't worry. Why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. Who's ready for puzzles? So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of... Changing the world just in a different way. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that, and well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. It's a fucking terrible serial name, the O's. Considered unethical. And there was this. Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee.
<laughs> Mass conspiracies, walls of crack. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Oh boy, okay. No good. Gotta reroute the circuit. Oh, hang on. Uh, right, do that. Oh, no, minus three I need. Uh, oh, are you fucking kidding? Uh, can I steal that one? Yeah, cool. Why don't you do the honors this time? I think we did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. You sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's well, a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. Man, it's really tragic how this game ends. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. Just because of how much they actually give a shit about each other. I mean, you know, this suit is because of Otto, you know? Hey, sorry I missed your call. Are you still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. All right, dinner at MJ's. No expectations. It'll be hard to screw this one up. Guess I'll just freelance for a while until she calls. Let's do a demon hideout, since that's close by. Do? Oh, I read Spider-Geddon. It's, uh, it's pretty fucking good. MJ, I'm at location number two. Can you believe these demons wear their masks just, like, walking around? Let's make for confusing staff meetings. I'll try to figure out their operation while you throw a wrench into it. Just one more to stealth. Web throw ten enemies, that's a piece of piss. But first. Not 
Ah, oh, shit. Legal weapons. And this might come as a shock, but I don't think they're really bespoke. The hipster assassins are going to be so disappointed. <laughs> it's not that I'm not glad to see more of you. It's. Oh, no, wait. It is that I'm not glad to see more of you. Come on, finish up the challenge. There we go. Now I can just kick some ass. shit. Nope. <laughs> Fucking hell. Jesus Christ. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, shit. Get over here! MJ, call the police. I've got the place secured. Nice job. Anytime we can get guns off the street, it's a win. So I only just learned recently that Queens isn't actually on the island that this game takes place in. I didn't realize that. Hey, MJ. All right, I picked up a bunch of stuff at the store. Can't wait to see what you come up with. Swinging over now. Prepare to be amazed. <laughs> Same with Brooklyn, actually. I didn't realize that Manhattan's just like one small part of New York. I also didn't realize that it was an isolated island before.
tell you, Triple J, I used to think you were exaggerating the danger to the city, but after the city hall bombing, I gotta admit, you were right. A lot of people have been telling me that, congratulating me, but I don't want to imagine. I would have loved to have been Better yet, for those in a position of power who listened to me and done something. They didn't, and I'm not sure they'll listen now. Unless concerned citizens like you and I make ourselves impossible to ignore. Stand up! Take your city back! That's the only way we can ever be sure that justice will be done. That and listening to me every day! God bless you, Jonah. What happened? So you know that address you gave me? I went there. MJ. I know, I know, but wait. What is this? Just listen. Oh, fuck. This is the address Pete found. Men are all carrying firearms. What is this place? That office. Might be something inside that connects this to Lee. Need to get back there. Huh? What was that? What dumbass can't put this shit away? Bet it was happy. Oh shit. Someone there. Wait. I hate these missions. I really wish Insomniac hadn't put these in. So what's the boss doing with the money from his lead job? What are they building? Is this all for Lee? Grave dust, man. All that gas is going straight yes. in grave dust. You tried any yet? Only samples. Boss is still perfecting the recipe, man. I just got a kick. Easy does it. Brave dust must have me on edge. What kind of vehicle needs tires this big? Where is it? I swear I left it over here. Has anyone seen the 316 socket driver? I just want to get this one over and done with as quickly as I can, to be honest. Later on she gets a taser and these become more bearable. 
Would have been nice if you could skip this on New Game Plus or something and just watch the cutscenes, maybe. You're right, Rick. Uh, won't notice. Uh, Cause it won't be there. God damn it! I said I'll fix it! Uh, you got some stones, Rick. <laughs> Let's see if they break. Such a disappointment. Well, worse things have happened at Applebee's. Come on now. I hear things. I hear things. Made it. Blueprints. An APC. This is what they're building for Lee. But why See you, do they need an armored vehicle? There must be some here we go. GPS trackers. What is Tombstone using these for? Alright, boys. Time to move. Get the gear for my office. Time to go. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway, here. Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never going to let me live that one down, are you? Nope. The Great Dumpling Catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. So, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but, but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves Devil's Breath. Whatever that is. Yeah. I'll dig into it. So I was thinking... What if we teamed up? But, what, you want to be my sidekick? Like a spider girl? Spider woman. No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A partner. Oh. Not again. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh! Oscorp CFO! Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did... Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Where do you want me to, uh... Just a couch is fine. <laughs> See you later? Yeah. Hey, it's me. This curry is legit. So what do we know about Charles Standish? 
Let's see. Chief Financial Officer Oscorp. Single. Known for his art collection. If Lee's after him, it's gotta be related to Devil's Breath. I'll run a search on everything in that file. Let me know the second you find something. I think Lee might be planning something even worse than City Hall. So, are we partners now? Cause it sure feels like we are. Partners? Uh, sounds good. Okay. See ya, partner. Police look like they could use some help. There's probably... Somebody was in a hurry. Spider-Man! You're hurt. I'm okay. But you gotta find Mr. Standish. Fast. Those guys in the masks kidnapped him and forced him up to his place. He lives in the penthouse. Top floor. Okay, sit tight. This is off. Sell it, huh? So glad you're here. I can't find my car. I could have sworn I parked on this level. You guys work here too? 
This building is serious about parking enforcement. Fight! A for effort! The elevator won't work, they know I'm here. But maybe I can sneak up through the elevator shaft. Should be able to make it up to the penthouse from here. Touch it now! easy. Tall building. Fire bombs? Seriously? Move! Standish. Okay, now what? Enter your password. He sounds nervous. Maybe I should take him out.
待调查。Okay, all clear. Hope Standish is all right. Let's try this again. It's safe now. What were they after? Just financial records. About Devil's Breath? How do you know about that? Why do they want it? I don't even know what it is. Mr. Osborne's been pouring money into it for years, but he keeps the whole project a secret. I'm the only one who has any record of it. Not anymore. Looks like they copied some records to a secure server. Payroll information on a Dr. Isaac Delaney. Who is he? I, I honestly don't know. Down! <laughs> <laughs> Okay? Yeah. I think so. Good. Good. You know, as elevator shafts go, this is pretty nice. Hey, Yuri. You okay? Yeah, but I didn't get much out of Standish before these Sable guys stepped in and told me to back off. What's the deal? I get the sense all they care about is keeping him quiet. Because he knows about Devil's Breath. Right. Whatever the hell that is. I'm working on that. I think I just got a lead. A lead? You sound like a cop. Don't you mean... Spider Cop? Uh, Yuri? That's fair. Peter, what happened with Standish? He's safe. Okay, good. And the demons? They were looking for a name. You got a pen? Yeah, go. Dr. Isaac Delaney. Okay. Who is he? What's his deal? I was hoping you could tell me. I'm on it. Just give me a few. Oh, and before I forget, you left that tracker from Tombstones at my place. I'll drop it at Dr. Octavius's lab. Let you know what I find on Delaney.